How's it going, everyone? My name is Michael SK, and welcome back to Detroit Become Human. In the last episode, things got really crazy. I was really on edge. The suspense was definitely there, and uh, I, I definitely needed a, uh, a break after that. That was a very suspenseful chapter uh, with Kara and Alice. I could have sworn we were going to lose Kara, because I don't think we're in the beginning of the game anymore. If I lose a character, I'm, I'm just going to have to deal with the fact that they are lost. But we're not with Kara anymore, we are with Connor. And I'm assuming we gotta go find What's-Her-Face again. Our, uh, our boss, so to speak. Uh, well, what's over here? I kinda wanna look around. Cause I actually have no fucking idea where we're even at. What's this? Oh shit, we can actually mess with this. Wow, I have, uh, I have never experienced such a uh, crazy thing. Let's touch it again. Is this like a, like a drug for androids? Oh, <laughs> okay, I guess we're done. I was gonna say, like, is that a drug for androids? Like, is this, is this what they like to go do? What are we doing? Oh, yep, we're gonna have to go find Amanda. Just like before. This place is really beautiful, though. I hope all these, uh, plants and stuff are... You know, all real and natural and not, uh, not technologically based. I think I see her over there in the distance, unless it's someone else. No, that's gotta be her. She was wearing some freaky clothes last time, and looks like she's wearing some freaky clothes this time. I don't know if there's anything else I can mess with. But yeah, we're back with good old Detroit Become Human. I think we're around halfway done, I'm not sure. I don't really know how to measure this since the story is uh, always changing to my Hello, choices. Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. Nice. Would you mind a little walk? It's fine. Let's use this umbrella that we were not using until now. She's not an android, though she was just standing there. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. Fuck. Uh. I have no excuse. I should have been more efficient. Did you manage to learn anything? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. What else? It was fascinated by birds. We've seen deviants interested in other life forms, like insects or pets. But nothing like this. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? I, I think it's actually pretty damn good. It's improving. I've come to understand him better, and he's growing accustomed to my presence. I feel like I'm going to become a disappointment to Amanda. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I'm pretty sure the media is already finding this out. this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Oh, shit. Find Anderson and investigate. Well, hopefully it doesn't end like the previous one. Because I really fucked that one up. You know, if Connor didn't have a, a, a baboon behind his back, a.k.a. me, things probably could have gone better, you know? The investigation chapters are always fun. At least we're friends with Hank, also known as Lieutenant Anderson. Let's see if there's anything we can find out here. I'm assuming this is his house. <laughs> Let's peek in through the window. Wow, a whole lot of nothing. Well, I tried. 
Let's uh, let's be proper and ring the good old door. Oh nope, we have to knock. Lieutenant Anderson. Anybody home? We have to find a way in. So we're going to break into his house. Well, ringing the doorbell is most definitely not going to work. We're going to have to break into his fucking house. It's not in his car. Maybe do something with the garage here? Nope. There's nothing we can do over here. I guess we got to try the other way. I don't think there's anything else we can do with the car here. It's most definitely locked. I saw the little blue light in the front. I guess we'll go around back. Or we'll throw a rock in through the window and climb in. That could work. Wait, why does he have a fence on one side but not the other? I don't get that. He actually could be outside. Oh, shit. He is unconscious. He's breathing. Lieutenant Anderson! Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> He's not gonna be happy with us. Easy, Sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. Good boy. Okay. So, I think, uh, I think the lieutenant had a little bit, uh, too much to drink here. You know, just, just, just a little bit much here of that black lamb, which is whiskey. And he had a... Oh, no. <laughs> I can already take a guess as to what the fuck he was doing. And I don't understand why. Uh... All right, he seems okay. Yep, he was definitely drinking. Lieutenant. <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant. <laughs> it's me, Connor. God damn it. I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey, you have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. It's working time. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. What a poor guy. Hey, hey. To the bathroom we go. Sumo, attack. Ah, oh, shit. Good job. What? Attack. How is he a good dog? Fuck, I think I'm going to be sick. Yeah, yeah, maybe, if you're drinking as much as I think you are. And playing fucking Russian roulette. Oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. Uh, no, you are. What the hell are you doing? <coughs> oh, I don't want a bath. Thank oh, you. we're going to pour Sorry, some nice man. cold water on him. I'm sorry, man. Time to twist the knobs. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world. Seems like he it. He gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> that also seems like Can't it. Can't you just leave me alone? Um. Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here. Tease? What the fuck? 
I understand. I sincerely hope you come to terms with your personal situation. I'm not gonna bother him if if he doesn't it's want me here. Side. What do we know about it? A man was found dead in a sex club downtown. Huh? The report says that an android may be involved. Oh. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. I don't know if I should snoop around here in the house. I don't know if I can do any snooping at all. There's nothing to do in here. I'm guessing this is the bedroom. I might be able to do some snooping in here. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Uh... You know what? Let's go over that hippie style today. I think, uh... I mean, if, especially with the location that we're going to, I think he kind of needs the hippie style. I think it'd be very helpful. There's no, there's nothing I can do. I can't investigate his house. All right, fuck it, I guess. Are you all right, Lieutenant? <coughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Just, I can uh, tell. Give me five minutes, okay? Sure. Poor man. Okay, now we can snoop around the house. I see that CNN is on, so we'll ignore that. Uh, he was definitely having some fun here. Oh, wait. Is that his son? Oh no. Oh no. What if it's Android related? That'd probably lead to his, uh. or explain his frustration and everything with the androids. Yeah, we, we, won't, we won't say anything about that. We'll, we'll just. We'll leave that alone. <laughs> be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Looking good, man. I mean, sir. It's a good boy. I want. I want to say that's a real boy. Yeah, he was playing Russian roulette. There were a lot of other things I could have done while waiting for Hank, but I felt like I didn't have the time, man. I didn't want to watch CNN. God damn it. Ah, oh, fuck. All right. Well, apparently he was playing Russian roulette. He, he's possibly suicidal. And I guess I can sort of understand why. He lost his son. I think we're with Marcus now. I really hope this isn't a... Uh, nope, nope. That is... Oh, wait. Yeah, this is the Jericho group. Yeah, so we're, we're definitely with Marcus. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. All right. Fine by me. I just hope this isn't a, uh, a stealth chapter in any sort of way. I will be uh, greatly disappointed if this is. Because I don't do stealth. I also don't deal with uh, suspense all too well. Don't let them see us. Well, duh. I'm just going to hide in the shadows here with uh, this lovely lady. I've already forgotten everyone's name. We haven't known them that long. Watch out. Ooh. Now what do we do? I'll find another way. All right, time to do some climbing. I mean, if we've got parkour to do, I know that uh, Marcus can do that parkour. But uh, me, on the other hand, I'm not really sure about that. I'm not really quick on my feet. Or at all. And in, in a video game, I mean, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, fuck. What the fuck are we doing?
Time to run, run, run. Oh, there we are. That's where we gotta go. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna go this way. This way seems fun. Marcus, Not really. Climb up here. I'm gonna follow north. Fuck. Alright, well, we're not separated yet, I think. I think we're all still here. I don't know where the fourth member of our group is. Oh, shit. Who's that? I think that's our fourth member. So he got ahead of us, alright. Fuck. That is some parkour right there. I haven't needed to do anything too crazy yet. So far, I'm just pressing the X button. Sorry, I'm late, guys. Cyber Life warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Leave it to me. I don't really know how we would get rid of him. Alright. Let's see what options we have. So we can run through here. Or run up there. Nope, that's not going to work. Okay, then we could run around and get spotted because that's a smart idea. We could, what else could we do? Oh, right here. So we run up here and, oh yeah, that's what I'm, that's what I'm enjoying. And then we would die. Uh, what other options? Oh, we could just wait. Ah, yeah. Then we would grab the drone. Yeah, let's go for it. Hopefully I don't fuck it up, you know? Like I said, Marcus is definitely the, uh, the pro at the parkour. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I don't... Okay, I was like, am I supposed to hold it down? Am I supposed to mash it? I'm a little You're confused okay? there. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Yeah, relationship up, building. Your bags. Take as much as you can. Oh shit, we're searching crates. Uh, yeah, you fucking got it. Um, how do I search crates? I wasn't, I wasn't taught how to do this. Well, they're doing the search. Oh, there we go. I guess it mattered which crate I would go to. Yeah. Look at these supplies.